uh, it's regarding our English Pastor Search Committee. So back in April, when I announced to our church leadership that I had taken a role with the International Mission Board, uh, I'd like to just commend our deacon and elder board for very quickly jumping into finding a new English pastor. And so they very quickly started off the English Pastor Search Committee, and very quickly the English Search uh, Pastor Search Committee nominated a candidate, which hopefully should not surprise all of you. Uh, the candidate is Pastor Rowe. And so for the last two months, uh, the English Pastor Search Committee have gone through his references, have talked to him regarding his salvation, his ministry calling, uh, looked at his qualifications as a pastor and as a shepherd of a church, uh, talked to the references that he provided. And so unanimously, they made the recommendation to the elder and deacon board uh, to consider Pastor Rowe as a candidate for the English pastor at our church. So about a week or two ago, the elders and the deacon board uh, came together and interviewed Pastor Rowe uh, and essentially asked him all the same questions. Uh, his calling, uh, his passion, his vision, uh, why he wanted this role, um, and things like that. And so unanimously, the elder board and the deacon board also voted uh, Pastor Rowe as a candidate. And so what you will hear as we begin to communicate this out to the church is that you will start seeing more communication. Uh, Pastor Ro will be preaching um, a couple times on the Chinese side. He will also be meeting with many small groups uh, just so that they can have a Q&A with him. In fact, in uh, July 5th, he will be preaching in the Chinese side and they will be doing a church-wide, uh, for the Chinese congregation, a Zoom session afterwards for them to interact with Pastor Ro. That is one of the many interactions that uh, are being scheduled out. So if you're in a small group, uh, don't worry, he's going to show up there. He'll be talking to you guys. You can talk to him. You can ask him uh, why, what, you know, essentially any questions you want regarding uh, this role that he's stepping into. And so the idea is for the next couple months, all that would happen, you will hear Pastor Ro more, uh, whether that's in small groups, whether that's with preaching, uh, eventually leading up to our October uh, congregation voting. And so the idea is that in October, we will officially vote Pastor Rowe in. And if he officially gets voted in, then he will officially become the English pastor. Uh, as for myself, I will remain a pastor in our church and I will continue to be on the elder board. So all these are good news. We praise God for the, um, the maturity and the growth that we're experiencing on the English side. We want all of you to be praying for Pastor Rowe and his family as they begin moving into this new season of their life. Uh, we thank you, God, for bringing their family to us three years back. Um, none of us knew that this would happen, that he would eventually step into this role, and so we give praises to God.